Hey folks, my name's Finn Morgan. This is a quick introduction to a game I've been working on for the past couple of years called Colorbind. Colorbind is a physics platformer. You control this car thing and you can spin your wheels clockwise and counterclockwise. You can embiggen them, you can lock them stationary. And you use these controls to reach each level's goal. There's a twist though, of course, and that is that here, gravity is controlled by color. So the arrows on these colored dials down here in the corner show the direction and the strength of the gravity that affects objects of that color. So as you can see here, for instance, red gravity is pretty normal, but blue objects fall to the left and green objects fall up. So when I push over this stack of boxes here, we can watch all how it works. As you progress, you'll learn more about how the gravity system interacts and hopefully right up until the end you'll be learning new things and making new discoveries about how the game's mechanics work. It's a game of skill as well as wit, so understanding how to solve a puzzle is the first part of the equation, but then you have to execute it. Colorbind's pretty hard. It, it doesn't start out that way, but I tried to make Colorbind a game where players will feel like they've achieved something when they finally finish it. I want players to still be facing new challenges, or pretty much no matter how good they get at it. For instance, there are medals that are awarded for faster times on each level, and often the gold medal requires a way faster time than the silver, uh, and that's because you'll have to solve the puzzle in a completely different, more efficient way. Some pretty common feedback I got for this while showing it around a uh, Melbourne indie scene was people really wanted to mess with a level editor for the game. And so indeed there is a level editor that'll get included. I thought I've pretty much invented all the cool things that you can do with the game's core mechanics, but I'm looking forward to being proven wrong on that. There's also a whole set of different puzzles for local co-op, specifically things that seemed really interesting but couldn't possibly be achieved without two players working together. Basically, Colorbind's a physics puzzle game for people who actually enjoy that feeling of when you see a new level and think, oh crap, they expect me to do that, knowing that it'll be all the sweeter when you've actually mastered it. So far, people playing the game have pretty much either loved it or hated it, but in both cases, it's because of the old school challenge and demand for mastery. So if that sounds like your thing, I hope you'll check it out. It's coming to all three operating systems pretty soon, and if I'm lucky, it'll be coming to some other platforms too.